Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today's video is going to be really fun. It is a get it all done with me and I have so many things I need to tackle this weekend. I'm currently sitting in the parking lot of Uptown Cheapskate, which is like a local consignment sell by clothing and shoe store here. So everything that I went through in my massive closet declutter video, I've brought here today. Anything that they don't take, I'm gonna to take to the Salvation Army or the Goodwill. And if you can hear all these cars buzzing around me, it's pretty loud, so I apologize. But I'm going to take everything in here and drop all of that off, and then I might shoot over to Marshall's because they're actually next door. See if they have any Valentine's things. I know I said that I was not gonna decorate for Valentine's Day, but. I kind of want to get a couple things through the house. So I might run in there, see what they've got. If they're not too busy crowds, I can't do a whole lot of crowds right now, but we're going to go see what all we can find and see what all we get for the clothing that I dropped off. But today's video is also a collaboration. So stay tuned and I will tell you all about it. So as I mentioned, today's video is a collaboration and it is with one of my very best friends here on YouTube. Her name is Tristina and her channel name is Tristina Rose. She is a stay-at-home mom of two beautiful boys, Tristan and Brayden, and she uploads videos on decor, cleaning, decluttering, and anything motherhood and lifestyle. She is so down to earth and easy to love. She has an infectious personality and I know you will love her. So make sure you go and watch her video as soon as you're finished with mine today. All of her information will be in the description box below. And if you're coming from Tristina's channel. Welcome, my name is Mandy and I'm so glad to have you here today. Trying to impress me, pulling out all the stops. Making my dizzy when you tell me what you want. I just wanted you to see me. Never thought you'd notice. Thought that you should know I'm already so Obviously, I did not go into Marshall's. They were so extremely busy. There's no way I was going to walk around in there. But I did go in Kirkland's, and I showed you guys a few things. They did not have a lot of Valentine's things. They had a whole bunch of Easter stuff that was out, but they've also got some new signs. And I briefly showed you guys the signs that they had. 
I could buy everything in there and have every wall of my house covered in signs if I could. But I also went back and went into Uptown Cheapskate. They called me and let me know that they were done. And they actually ended up giving me $93 in cash. I think it was going to be like a hundred and. 16 or something like that in store credit but the whole point of me decluttering my closet was to not keep adding more things to it so i decided to take the cash instead and i pulled up to the curb because if you guys watched that video you saw all those totes that i had full of things and i'm not exactly sure what all they took it really didn't even matter because it was all going to go to the um salvation army anyways so i said okay yeah that's fine i just took the money and i heard somebody say that they were donating the rest of them that they would keep them and i was like okay so anything that you guys don't take if i don't take home you donate to the rescue mission and she said yes and i was like sign me up that way i don't have to load up my car again and then drive over and unload it one more time so they handled all of that everything that they didn't take they were actually going to take to the salvation army anyway so that's perfectly fine and now i'm in the parking lot of kroger i need to go in and get some chicken for tonight's dinner and it just so happens to be next door to the liquor store and it's Saturday and why not right so I might jump in there try to find me something to sip on I'm gonna go in Kroger get my food and then I'm gonna go home and yeah then we're gonna get the rest of the day going I know it's nothing new but it's so good to see you This every day, and I'm still so amazed by you. So hold me tight through the night. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's just us two. Gonna go ahead and get dinner started and this is a new recipe that i found if you guys have ever had it let me know if you have not you've definitely got to try it it is called lasagna soup and i love lasagna but it takes so many steps and sometimes i just get really frustrated with it and it takes forever so i thought this would be the next best thing and it absolutely was so what you're going to do is take one pound of italian sausage and get that browned drain the fat if you want to and then you're going to add two to three cups of your your favorite pasta sauce and then I added one can of chicken broth and one can of beef broth 
and a can of petite diced tomatoes. And then you're going to add your seasonings. You can add whatever you like, but I did add some onion powder, some garlic salt, some seasonal, and some other like Italian blend spices. But like I said, you can add whatever you'd like. But then after that, you're going to take a box of your lasagna noodles. Make sure you break those up into small pieces. And then you're going to make sure that all of that is settled in there. Make sure that none of your lasagna pieces are sticking out. Then you're going to bring that to a boil and cover it. And you're going to let that boil for about eight minutes and while that's doing its thing on the oven to the side you're going to take some ricotta cheese and I did some mozzarella shredded and also some Italian shredded cheese and I mixed that up and I added a little bit more of the seasonal to that and then once your eight minutes is over you're going to take just like a dollop of that cheese mixture and add it in there and then you're going to add one cup of heavy whipping cream mix all that together put your lid back on and let that simmer for another probably two minutes I think was about what I did and then it's finished and it is so stinking delicious but the extra little cheese mixture that you have when you serve the soup you can add just a little dollop to the top of that for some garnishment and some extra goodness <laughs> Wake up at mine Same question always I'm getting tired We could have breakfast Got in your freckles Close to the west coast How about that? Why don't we just get a place together? Morning's in our own bed So much better Balconies and back You guys, that lasagna soup was so delicious. I was kind of leery at first. I did see the recipe online and I was like, okay, we'll give it a shot. I originally was gonna do the chicken that Jessica Donahue did a few weeks back, but I saw that recipe and I had to try it. So if you guys decide to make it, let me know what you think. It's super easy and literally takes like 10 minutes. If you like lasagna, you're definitely gonna love it. It tastes exactly like it. And all I did was use, um, just like some Italian bread I bought from the store and just cut it into slices and we use that like for our little side but if you decided to do like a salad with it or anything like that that would be perfect too so let me know if you decide to make it and tell me what you guys think I thought it was amazing full of flavor just hit the spot it wasn't like really heavy perfect um, but now I'm gonna go ahead and fold these clothes that have been in my dryer since this morning I'm really bad about that. So I'm gonna go ahead and do those, that way they're done for tomorrow. I bet you think that I should calm down And that I'm overthinking everything about you And that we're good the way we are Yeah. 
you for the first time mm. You know we should work it out You know we should work it out Before I'm too invested I should probably ask you Ask you all my questions Get to know you better But can you be trusted? Will you take me for granted? Okay, you guys, all my laundry is done. I'm gonna go ahead and hang everything up, put everything away. I've got my jammies on. I have already cleaned up after dinner. Everything is nice and quiet around here. So that is all I'm gonna do for today. I try not to push myself, but I also try to get done as much as I can if I've got a day that I don't have anything else that I have to do. So I just like to get everything done that I possibly can. I still have some things I need to do. I might tackle that tomorrow. I've got some returns I need to do to Target. So I might head out there and do that. But other than that, I'm done for the day. Now I'm just going to relax and enjoy the rest of my evening. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to go and watch Tristina's video after this. Tell her I said hello give her some love from me but that's all that I have for you guys today I really hope you enjoyed it and as always I love you and I appreciate you and I will see you next time bye you